Hey guys, what's going on? This is Addison from LeSueur Car Company, and I'm gonna show you a quick tutorial on how to use the regenerative braking in your 2019 Audi e-tron Prestige. Let's get right to it. So in order to get there, you go to vehicle, you go to charging and efficiency, and you go to efficiency assist. And you're met with two different recuperation methods. We got manual and automatic. And just like a manual or an automatic, you have more control with the manual. With the automatic, it will kind of do it on its own. Something that I would point out is I would rather use it in manual because you'll actually save a lot more battery doing that. But with that, in order to kind of use it, you have to use these little pedals right here, the little manual pedals. So if you press down here, boop, you'll actually see a little line comes up on the cluster. And if you press it again, boop, you'll actually see that the line goes down. So that means that you actually can charge a little bit more in your vehicle. All right, so right now we're at a different part of the lot because I wanna show you how this works. So basically we're at the maximum amount that we can recharge at this moment. And the cool thing about this is it actually has kind of a braking system to it too because it's actually trying to gather all of that energy. So let's take it for just a slight spin. So as we continue to go, we're kind of passing by the ID4s, awesome vehicles. You can tell that we're using about 10%, 15% around there. But if we let go off the pedal, you can tell that it starts charging which is amazing if you're going downhill. So let's kind of go for a little bit longer. So we're gonna make a left right here, kind of take a little bit of a circle. You can tell that we're using a little bit of our battery. And I'm not gonna gun it too hard, but I'm gonna kind of go to like 25%. I'm gonna let go, and it's gonna start charging again, which is going to back the maximum amount that we can recharge. So that is really cool. And with that and the addition to the range monitor, you can actually save a lot more battery than you think. So anyways, guys, that is a quick tutorial on how to use the regenerative braking in your Audi e-tron, and I will see you guys in the next video. See ya!